The late 1870s was actually a small revolution in, in American architecture. The most popular style was probably the Second Empire with its mansard roof. But that was a style that was extremely frustrating for architects with any originality. And they were always looking for ways to escape the box of the mansard style and offer their clients something creative. William Ralph Emerson wasn't just interested in copying historical styles, he was constantly searching for new ways to express himself and offer his clients something new and original in terms of the designs for their homes. It's really a starter home for a young couple whose um, parents lived on either side of this estate. Edith Hemingway's parents lived on one side of the estate and W.E.C. Eustace's family lived on the other side of the estate. And when the two got married in 1876, together between the two estates, this estate was established, mostly funded by um, Edith Hemingway's uh, mother, who had a great deal of money. What we see in the Eustace House, what Emerson was trying to do, I believe, was use the same principle of looking at vernacular building traditions to create something new and original. It's a masonry building, for one thing, so it's not the, the shingle style that Emerson is normally associated with. But uh, the Eustaces, of course, were building a country house, a house, uh, a large estate and not surprisingly, they wanted a masonry building. While this was a country estate for a wealthy New England family, uh, W.E.C. Eustace, who was the patriarch of the family, also wanted it to be a working farm as well. First and foremost, what you notice when you're driving up and approaching the house is these massive stone porches, the porch on the front and the port corsier at the end of the L.A. But then as you look at it closely and you can realize that, well, actually, you know, there's no reason for these, this stone porch. There's no reason for the stone porch in terms of structure. It's way overbuilt. When Emerson designed this house, he designed it for this site. There are windows that were placed to frame a particular aspect of the landscape. He's trying to offer his clients something creatively different. And, it, and clearly, the, the Eustace house does not look like any other house that I can think of in the period. 